evening. First off the top tonight, we've got breaking news at Hurricane Harbor at the water park where Arlington police are investigating a deadly shooting. Brooke Katz has made her way. She joins us live. Talk to us about what we know right now. Yeah, and Doug, it is still an active scene out here. I want to show you behind me. You can see Arlington police still on this scene. We do know a teenager was shot. He was hit by gunfire in the parking lot here. This is near the entrance, and this all happened just as the water park was closing for the evening. Police say the victim was about 16 years old. He was taken to a nearby hospital where he was pronounced dead. Police say a Hurricane Harbor security officer, who's also an off-duty officer, heard honking in that parking lot. When he went to investigate, he realized there was a fire with several people throwing punches. This all happened again in the parking lot. They're still interviewing those people. They have detained some of them. We're told that they have been taken to the police department where they're speaking with them as we speak right now. They also want to talk to any witnesses who might have seen what happened as they were leaving Hurricane Harbor for the evening. We would ask anybody that was leaving Hurricane Harbor that may know some information or know what happened to please come forward. Let's we'll call 911 and we'll put you in contact with one of our investigators. Uh, police say they don't know yet if the people that they've detained were actually involved with this or not. They say right now those people are denying involvement. The security officer reports there were between six and eight people who were involved with that fight before that gun went off. Doug? Brooke Katz, thank you for bringing us up to speed. A lot of people talking about it on social media.